Lesson 11, Leadership Through the Years, created by Erica Minky. Pierre Trudeau. Pierre Trudeau was born on October 18, 1919, and was raised in the suburb of Outremont, Montreal. His mother, Grace Elliott, was of French descent, so Trudeau and his two siblings grew up speaking both French and English. Pierre's family was very wealthy as his father was a businessman and a lawyer. Pierre then went off to receive a law degree from the University of Montreal and shortly after started working a position at a desk officer for the Privy Council. He practiced law in 1951 to 1961 and specialized in labor and civil liberty cases. In 1961, he became a staff member of the University of Montreal as a council law professor. Four years later, the Liberal Party was searching for candidates. Him and two others were invited to run for party seats and Trudeau became Minister of Justice. Pierre's personality meshed well with others and changed many's, many people's opinion and attitudes in the late 1960s. Graduating from the elite Jean de, de Brough College, practicing law from 1951 to 1961, 1961 becoming a professor of constitutional law at Montreal University, became Minister of Justice, changed attitudes and opinions of, in, of the late 1960s, reformed the divorce laws, liberalized the laws of abortion and homosexuality, become, becoming Prime Minister in 1968, bought the universal health care, Mary Margaret Sinclair in 1971. Trudeau led our country through many challenges, like the 1970 October crisis that tested his stance against terrorists, the War Measuring Act, and the refund refundment to give Quebec sovereignty, and the 1982 Constitutional Act for Canada, and completed the separation from Britain. All of these monumental acts have brought new and widespread civil rights for all of Canadians. Pierre's leadership qualities. Charismatic. He was able to charm others to widen their views and change their perspective. And dramatic. He was able to implant himself into others' lives and start tackling problems that many didn't even notice. Humble. Which is assumed by one of his famous quotes. The past is to be respected and acknowledged, but not to be worshipped. It is the future which we find our greatness. Pierre Trudeau, 1970. Bibliography. David Riel was born near Red River, which is now Winnipeg, Manitoba. On October 22, 1844, from the beginning of his formal education, Riel was a star student, and that's where he developed his love for poetry. He was given a scholarship to study at Selkins School in Montreal, where he met a young French-Canadian woman, Julie, Marie Julie Gononam, which he fell madly in love with, but her parents refused to allow her to marry a Métis man, and Riel left and moved back to Red River. Louis Riel's Accomplishments March 11, 1992, a motion honoring, honoring Riel as a founder of Manitoba is passed aimlessly. However, the motion does not include a pardon. 1998, two Liberal MPs launched a private member bill to overturn Riel's conviction. While it gained the support of all federal parties and the blessing of Riel's family, Métis leaders said that it did, not, it did nothing to advance Riel's causes. 2002, a web poll after the televised CBC Mock trial finds Riel not guilty of high treason. Out of 9,657 votes, a whooping 87% were found not guilty for the death. 2004, former Prime Minister Paul Martin vows that the government will rethink Mr. Riel's role in Canadian's history. Theroux Riel's personality traits. A father of Manitoba and Confederation. 
rebel, to go against something that was something bigger than himself and to gain, to gain the respect for his people. Bravery, because he wasn't afraid to do what was right. Headstrong, because he was, it was very hard to change his opinion or beliefs. Down to earth, with strong ideas about what's right and wrong. Hardworking, because he would rather take the hard way than the easy way. Adaptable in many different situations. Example, his learning environment. Justin Trudeau. Justin was born into a famously wealthy family on December 25th, 1971. Justin spent his earlier years in the spotlight as the oldest son of former Prime Minister Pierre Trudeau. American President Richard Nixon predicted Justin's future at a state dinner with Trudeau's, fa with Trudeau's father. Nixon made a toast to the future Prime Minister of Canada, Justin Trudeau. Trudeau followed his father's footsteps by going to the same school as he did, John Diday Brook. After college, Justin worked as a math teacher for many years before entering politics in, nine, in 2006. In 2013, Trudeau became a leader of the Liberal Party and won the election in 2015 and becoming the second youngest Prime Minister. Justin Trudeau's accomplishments. Became a, became a math teacher in 1998, elected as Prime Minister in 2013 and promised Canadians a real change. Won the elections in October 2015 and became the second youngest Prime Minister. Appointed half of his cabinet positions to women, making a general balanced cabinet because it's 2015. Asserted an oil pipeline that transferred oil from Alberta to British Columbia. Justin Trudeau's personality traits. A teacher, extraordinary drive and determination that and doesn't let anyone get in way of his goals. Strive to grow and change, has the courage to wander from old traditions. This is my bibliography. Similarities between the three leaders. All three leaders have one main thing in common. They were all strong-minded. They see something that needed change and, and demanded for it, which in itself is very ambitious. They are also honorable and admirable, which in my opinions are the top traits in my leadership goal. And I hope to mirror them in my day-to-day -day experiences. Thank you for watching.